Hi, I'm Trev Hutchings, and this is how to add a new track to your project in Pro Tools. New tracks are added just below the currently selected track. So first, click on a track in your project where you want the new track or tracks to be added. Now click on the Track tab at the top left of the Pro Tools window. Then click on New on the pop-up menu. The New Tracks window will appear on the screen. You can click on the text box to the right of the word Create and type in a number if you want to add more than one track. Type on the drop list to the right of the word new and click on mono on the pop-up menu. For tracks that only have one input and one output source, like vocals and guitars. Or click on stereo for tracks that have two inputs and two output sources, like synths and virtual instrument plugins. Click on the drop list that currently says Audio Track and click on Audio Track on the pop-up menu if your track input source is an audio input on your audio interface. Or click on Instrument Track if you want to create a virtual instrument track. Other options include MIDI track if you want a MIDI note track that can send MIDI to a virtual instrument track or an external MIDI device. And track presets where you can do things like create a virtual instrument track that already has the Expand To plugin added. By clicking on Track Presets, clicking on Avid, clicking on Air Instruments Bundle, clicking on Expand To, and clicking on a category like Synth Arpeggios. The next drop-down list currently says Ticks. Ticks means the track contents will be linked to the tempo of your project, which means MIDI notes and the starting point of an audio recording will be locked to its position on the bar measurements. So if you change the project tempo, the speed of the MIDI beat will also change to the new tempo, or the starting point of an audio recording will move to line up with the new position of its bar measure point. Normally you will leave this on ticks, but you can click on the drop down list and click on samples. If you want the position of your track contents to be absolute and not change, even if you change the project tempo. Click on the text box to the right of the word Name and type in a name for your new track. If you want to add more tracks, click on the plus icon. Click on the minus icon to remove a track. Finally, click on Create to add the track or tracks to your project.
If you enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.